commission all the drama, I take an overview of it, but essentially I'm there to create a working environment which is the best place for people to work. And secondly, to talk about what BBC drama is and should be. So essentially it is a broad overview internally and externally of BBC drama. We've got three channels that we programme for, BBC One, BBC Two, BBC Three. BBC One is the mainstream channel. Um, it's there to offer all iterations of what mainstream drama should be. So there isn't a particular show where you go, that is what BBC One is. It's the combination of shows. It's EastEnders, Next to Luther, um, Next to Call the Midwife, Next to Birdsong, Next to Sherlock. It's the combination of shows, the range and diversity that makes BBC One um, what it is and that's because ultimately all of our audiences are as important as everyone else because they all pay for the licence fee. So range and diversity on BBC One and the um, imagination of its mainstream offering is key. BBC Two is about a sort of alternative authorship, an alternative view of the world. Um, so pieces like Shadow Lion, Crimson Petal um, give you a sense of coming into world at an acute angle. Uh, and then B BBC Three is about incredibly imaginative, younger skewed dramas like uh, Being Human. It is rare for them to jump between. Sometimes a show developed for two can end up on one and vice versa and from one to two. And it's all about tone, really. Um, it's about sometimes you may feel that a particular show will feel more engaged on BBC One and would actually feel smaller on BBC Two. But sometimes you'll feel that the tone of a piece that's done for BBC One will feel more comfortable and the team will have more ability to develop it in the way they want to on BBC Two. Writers are obviously what we're all about, everything comes back to the writer. The best way for them to go about um, sending their scripts in is if they don't have an agent to go to the writer's room, the writer's room is the support facility within the BBC to give you feedback and give you advice. Um, the key though to actually moving then into production is to have an agent, so going and get an agent is crucial. Once you've got that, approaching the BBC is easy, you can either come to the in-house department run by Kate Harwood or you can come to the indie department through an independent producer which is um, run by Polly Hill, Matthew Reed, and Lucy Richer. Um, so there are many ways in but it does rely on you having an agent. I think that you've got to be wary of anyone who feels because a particular type of programming has been a hit that another one will be. So obviously Call the Midwife and Downton have both been huge. Absolutely doesn't mean we won't commission other period dramas, we have done, but you've got to be incredibly conscious that each time you do it there's got to be something rich and original about it. So I'd always say it's about the individual programme. Um, I would personally ignore trends, I don't think they're that useful. I think you make trends by creating great shows and the thing that you didn't know you want is often the thing that you want and is the biggest hit. The process of writing is all about trying to help a writer get the very best of their idea on the page and whether you're a new writer or an established writer um, I don't think that sets you up any better really so I, I just think that's the process of writing is getting something down on the page and people helping them make it the very best they can be. We're the biggest provider of drama, I guess that's key. Um, we spend well over 200 million on drama every year and we make about 450 hours. Um, but second to that, we are the only non-commercial broadcast making drama and that does mean that we can have a range of drama and audiences matter to us no matter how old or young you are and that's not true for other broadcasters who completely understandably have to cater to specific demographics they make brilliant drama this is a question of range only really rather than quality and we can deliver the greatest range um, and I think that without question sets us apart